What you've got to also remember with property investing is it is a journey, especially if you're working towards achieving financial freedom, which I'm pretty certain every single person watching this video right now is striving to achieve financial freedom in the future. And that's not going to happen from one property. So you really want to make sure that you approach your mortgage broker with a plan. <laughs> I'd feel really confident to bet money that if you ask any successful property investor if they use a mortgage broker or not, the answer would be yes. And in today's video, I'm gonna break down exactly why smart investors use a mortgage broker and what it is that they do. So a mortgage broker is an independent person that helps you secure finance when purchasing a new home, whether that be your own home or an investment property. They're the ones that are actually gonna go and communicate with the banks and figure out the best rate that they can get you, how much it's gonna cost you on a monthly basis, how long you're gonna be in the loan for, how you can use this to get into further properties. So they are so important to have a quality one in, in your back pocket. Over the last 10 years, we've worked with over 12 different mortgage brokers, so it can be pretty difficult to find a really good one, but still there is some absolute crackers out there. So why use them? Number one, to outsource something that you're not the best at. These guys do this day in and day out. They've got access to over 20 different banks, most of them do, where you might only be able to go in and communicate with three or four different ones. It also just outsources it. Your time is precious and important, so you wanna make sure that you are aware of how much time it takes you to do these types of things. If you can outsource this to the broker, so much easier and you know you're gonna get the right result if you've got the right broker in your back pocket. And the best thing there is about a mortgage broker, you don't pay for them. The banks actually pay the mortgage brokers as well. Now this is something that you need to be weary of because some mortgage brokers will Incentiv will be incentivized to go to certain banks, but you just need to ask them the right questions so that they're not going to a specific bank where they may get a higher commission or something like this. Um, but that is the beautiful thing about mortgage brokers. They will go above and beyond for you to get you an amazing result and you don't even have to pay them. So you should definitely be going out there and finding one. So how do you find a great mortgage broker? Well, Trustio Google is definitely gonna help. I do think that you're gonna to have to talk to a couple of them before you find the right broker. I would recommend talking to somebody in your life who has already bought a couple of properties because it's likely that they've used a broker and they may have somebody that they can refer you to. You know, ask somebody in your life that's a property investor, whether that be a colleague, your auntie, uncle, mum, dad, brother, sister, cousin, whoever it is, Ask them and I'm sure they've got a recommendation of somebody that you can get in contact with. Otherwise, there is so many different brokers online and um, you can just get in contact with them, have an initial consultation and get a bit of a feel for it. So a few of the questions that you're gonna to wanna to ask those mortgage brokers in that consultation to just get a bit of a feel from them as to whether or not they've got your best interests at the top of their mind or not. So the first is how many banks do you have access to? This is a really important one to get a bit of an indication from because then you can expect that they're gonna be able to look at a variety of different options for you and really get you the best result. The next is, do you actually invest in property yourself? I personally think it's really important to have a mortgage broker that is a property investor themselves because then they know why you're doing this sort of stuff because they've been there, done that before. My mortgage broker is a super successful property investor and he has helped me get out of so many tricky situations which if I were doing it alone, I would have lost the deal, no doubt about it. So having somebody that's a successful investor is really important as well. Another question is why are they suggesting a certain bank? That's a really important question to ask as well because you wanna know whether or not you've got a financial incentive to go to a certain bank. So by asking these types of questions, you should be able to get a pretty damn good indication because if the answer is something along the lines of because that's the best rate and it's gonna give you the most, it's gonna cost you the least amount of money, then thumbs up. That's generally a very good answer there. So make sure that you get a decent feel from these guys and, and make sure that you know they're keeping your best interests at the top of the mind. 
What you've got to also remember with property investing is it is a journey, especially if you're working towards achieving financial freedom, which I'm pretty certain every single person watching this video right now is striving to achieve financial freedom in the future. And that's not going to happen from one property. So you really want to make sure that you approach your mortgage broker with a plan saying, G'day, this is what I'm really looking to achieve. I want to get into the property market within the next three months. This is my situation. But within 18 months, I want to be purchasing my second property. So I need to make sure that I'm going down the right path so that I'm set up in the right way that I'm going to be able to continue moving forward with my journey and continue accumulating properties. And, you know, most mortgage brokers have some sort of financial license that's going to enable them to provide you with some advice and feedback, and they're definitely going to be able to help you get an amazing result. Mortgage brokers have definitely taken so much stress out of my mind. They've opened my eyes up to a whole bunch of different banks as well that I never even knew existed out there. They've helped me save thousands and thousands of dollars every single year in, in interest repayments. So it is certainly worth your while to go out there and do your homework, do the research, talk to a number of different brokers, find the right one that's gonna help you get the best results so that you can continue investing confidently. So just to recap on that one, the questions that you wanna ask is, how many banks do you have access to? Are you a property investor yourself? Why are you suggesting this particular bank and how can you help me throughout my journey as well? So thank you so much for tuning in today, guys. If you haven't already done so, please subscribe. If you have a friend or somebody in your community that's about to start property investing themselves and they're starting to communicate with their local bank manager, then maybe flick them through this video so that they can understand the value of a mortgage broker and they can go out there and find one themselves. You know, we're not alone in this guys. Let's work together to help each other get the best possible result. Thanks so much for tuning in again, guys. And once again, you're one step closer. Oh, sweaty, so sweaty.